be gone. Babe. Huh. Oh. Waffetub, the Before you can enter cheats, you need to open the cheat console. To open it on PC, press Control and Shift and C while in the game. After pressing these, the cheat dialog box will appear on the top of the screen. Type your cheat, then press Enter. Press Escape to close the cheat console. For example, if you want to cheat for more simoleons, press Control and Shift and C to open the cheat console, then type in the cheat. In this case, we will type Motherload for 50,000 simoleons. When you're finished typing your cheat, press enter and hit escape to close the cheat console. And that's it. You now have 50,000 extra simoleons for your sims to spend. I'll show you another example. Let's say I want my sims to move into a house for free. Whether you're starting a new game or moving into a new home, make sure that you're in the world view and open the cheat console. Press Control and Shift and C and type free real estate space on. Then press enter. Now, all residential lots should be available. Cheating in the game isn't just easy, it's encouraged. There's so many cheats available, but there's also many mods and custom content available for you for free. I do want to note that some cheats might require to type might require you to type a command into the cheat console prior to entering the cheat or using the cheat. Most websites are pretty good at telling you if you need to use the testing cheats on command for that cheat. If your cheat doesn't seem to be working and it's spelled right as well as being a recognized cheat, then try the testing cheats command first. To do this, open the cheat console by pressing Ctrl and Shift and C, then type testing cheats on, then press enter. Then type your cheat and press enter again. This should do the trick. I also want to note that the testing cheats on command can be typed as testing cheats true. Either way will work. When you use cheats that can be turned on and off, you can use true for on and false for off. You might also see it written as testing cheats enabled true. All those versions should work, but I personally use testing cheats on. Now you have more control over your gameplay and the possibilities are endless. I hope you enjoyed this video and let me know what is your favorite Sims 4 cheat. Thanks for watching. Happy gaming.